Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games, and tonight we're going to be playing some Atari 2600 Ooh. games, uh, continuing on with the uh, playthrough of the nominees Yay, for the 5th nominees. Annual Atari Homebrew Awards, yeah. so the best of the best of the best, as voted by the nomination committee, mm -hmm. and then voted by you. So we're going to be, uh, so last show we went through Atari 2600 Homebrew Original mm -hmm. and Atari 2600 Homebrew Port. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to go into the kind of subcategories with yeah, 2600 graphic, uh, graphics, nice. music and sound nice. for originals and ports, mm -hmm. and also uh, the 4K and under games. Nice. So, oh, Esmeralds has the same shirt. Yeah. <laughs> it's a nice shirt. Good taste, I, I good like, taste. I like the, yeah, the I like fake that too. car manuals. Yeah, for, yeah. I don't know if they actually make manuals other than manuals for cars, but that's what I know them for. Yeah, no, it's nice. I like that. Uh, I need that shirt, says Chitlitla. Yeah, it's I think it's shirt. fairly available online. Yeah. So you just look for Haynes Atari 2600 and, and you should be able to find I it. I think you might have picked the color for it. Like it's one of oh, these where yes. it's print on demand. So that's you can right. pick what background color you want, if I'm yeah, not mistaken. I'm pretty sure because this would not be a, a standard I don't know. kind of a, I don't know, mm. off red color. Oh, <laughs> it's a popular shirt, apparently. Yes, there you go. <laughs> uh, oh, let me get rid of that shine coming from the side there. There we go. Um, so, yeah, uh, like I said, uh, we're going to be playing some 2600 games Yay. tonight, some fun ones. Um, but first, um, uh, we're going to read off some names okay. of the supporters These of the names? show. Subscribe. Did you just push that sign crooked bad cat these names <laughs> ace 3093 alnifer arkham h seven arms guard coder atari xl rules atari 1974 atari 2600 dude atari age beef supreme beer poker buck owens chassis don Mal, charles will and chive five colonel lama cuban is no dianoid dan if you see daryl 97 deduct mood cows granular snow great offender ground trooper roger rapper johnny wc carl g ken jennings evader gavalta for gnl amda express lauren tdz mad max Mark Yannis, Mark Spence, Mick Muse, Mike Soul, Mike Littell, Miss Command, MK Smith, Mr. Zarna Whoop, Mr. Fix, Muddy Funster, Nathan Strum, Neo Media, Nostalgic Old Style, Pack Rav, VG Quag, R. Enchwitz, Raymond C. R. C. 70 Rendered Ghost, Repentless, VG Reactor, Gamer, uh, Ricardo Pim, Six Sweet, a Silicone Toad, that's a new one, Smitty B. 7800, Smoke Spiceware, S. Ramirez, The D Train, Welsh Man, Tiki Dan K, Teat Foes, TM Events, 2600, Vitoko, and X Ken X. And if you want to be on that list and support the show and get rid of those ads from Twitch, um, mm -hmm. Just hit subscribe, Yay. and it's free. If you have Amazon Prime, just mm -hmm. link it up. Um, and I do have a poll question, kind of a, a weird one, I guess. Uh, let me put it on the screen. There you go. How many names per minute is he up to now? That's a good oh, question. Somebody will have to calculate that. Cal calculate the minutes and how many names. 70 names there. Nice. And then you can just Very divide nice. by how long it took. <laughs> Names per second, yeah. at least one per second. Yeah, I think so. Has watching ZPH, that's a very meta question, meta. Um, influenced you to, you to play a system you haven't played before? You oh, hadn't so played before. Not a game, but a system. A system, any game on another system. Okay. Okay. So hmm. it's like, oh, I played 2600, but when I started watching your show, I saw some 7800 yeah. games and yeah. I loaded up an emulator or bought a 7800. So is it is it allowing, is it encouraging you to cross to a different platform is what you're kind of course, saying, a lot of people here are going to say no, no. because <laughs> they already had all those. Yeah. Um, and I'm oh, going to say... Oh, S. Ramirez bought a Vectrix. There you go. Oh, well, that's a, that's a one. Yeah. And I'm going to say one because I didn't have a lot of these systems yeah, when I first started. started. Yeah, yeah, I didn't true. have the Lynx for sure. The Lynx, the Jaguar, yeah. Atari 8 bit. I had a 7800. Okay. Um, I think that covers it because <laughs> mm -hmm. I had a 2600 as well. Mm -hmm. um, oh, so one for yes, two for no, and three, I don't watch ZPH. <laughs> it's so silly. Obviously, you watch ZPH. Uh, that's impossible not to. Option three looking so low. No. It's, it's an impossible thing to vote for. Yeah. And if you vote for it, you're lying because you're watching it right now. Exactly. Or you're just looking at the chat for you, some you've reason. Somehow you've somehow hacked the chat and never watched the show. You've never watched the video and yeah. somehow ended up on the chat. Yeah, that, that would be an That'd interesting. That'd be very strange. Um, continuing on with the meta theme. Mm -hmm. um, Carl G. Illogical, illogical. <laughs> yes. Brain exploding. Yeah. 
And uh, yeah, also speaking of trying to explode brains of yep. computers, um, chat GPT. Oh, geez. Uh, um, uh, this was oh, yeah. uh, posted by Andrew Davey, and he asked a question about Zero Page Homebrew. And I just ran across this. Well, didn't run across this. I was alerted yeah. to it because yeah. that's how it works. Um, if And he asked, oh, not that thing. <laughs> if James and Tanya on the ZPH show decided to get another cat, what would be the most logical name for it? Of course, you pose it as logical because yeah. it's a computer. Yeah. Um, I don't want to hear from you that you don't give opinions. <laughs> You have to tell it that sometimes. Really? Yeah. Give one anyway. Give one anyway. The name's Pixel, Sprite, and Atari already taken. Explain in detail the reason for your choice, not wow. just a choice. Wow. 6507. Nice. A little hard to, it doesn't really roll off the tongue, but 6507's a cool name. Mm. Or, or 6502. Uh, if James Atani on the ZPH show decided to get another cat and the name's Pixel, Sprite, and Atari already taken, a logical name for it could be Blip. Which is kind of cute. Oh, kinda blip. Cute. Look at little blip. Little over blip. There. Uh, the reason for this choice is blip is a term commonly used in the context of classic video games. Blah, 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 blah. But look at this. Uh, this name would fit into the theme of classic video gaming, which he didn't say it was a classic video game. He didn't say it was zero, zero page, page homebrew or Twitch. Um, and would be fun and fitting nod to the world of classic gaming. So it knows about our show. That from is the, kind of creepy. From the context of <laughs> maybe the cat's names, our names, the ZPH. James and Tanya ZPH. Would be enough, obviously. That is kind of freaky, though. Then he followed up with logical name for it. I don't want to hear from you. You don't give opinions. Uh, oh, what is going on? Oh, yeah. Well, he asked again. I don't okay. Know. It's, something's going a little bit weird because it has more than this. Um, and the other name is Retro that uh, chat mm. GPT came up with. Uh, blip is a little cuter. Retro's okay. Yeah. And Nostalgia 26 says, Blip would turn out to be a 25 pound Maine Coon. <laughs> just yep. huge. Just yep. a chonker. <laughs> yeah. Blip is cute though. Actually, that's not, not a horrible, not horrible recommendation. And we did actually ask the chat before we got Sprite yeah. some names. And I don't know if Sprite was part one of those I think names. It, I, I think, think it was. was. Yeah. I think it was. Yeah, when we asked the chat. Yeah. But it was just a little creepy that it linked ZPH to Zero Page Homebrew. Mm, yep. Um... And it's called it the Zero Page Homebrew Twitch Show. So obviously it was able to look it up and figure out the context for it. Yeah. Uh, um, and maybe, I don't know, if S Pixel, Sprite, and Atari feed into that too. But uh, Yeah, and very, I wonder if it would pick interesting. Pixel, Sprite, and Atari names if it wasn't prompted with those names and just given yeah, our show. I don't know. Where it would be like, yeah, you already have appropriate cat names. That's uh, funny. So, in the world of emulation, uh, in terms of Jaguar, um, there was an update to Big PEMU, uh, which is now the kind of premier emulator for the Jaguar, um, which was included on the 50th anniversary mm -hmm. CD for emulating Jaguar games. <laughs> I know, the show's going and you haven't been fed yet. Yeah. It's a travesty. He's like, I like Blip. Blip <laughs> would be good. Can we can, have another kitten, please? Please get a Blip, a little yeah. kitten I can beat up. Yes. <laughs> um, uh, uh, there's been an update 1.05 uh, the biggest feature is Jaguar CD emulation mm. uh, has been pretty well conquered so it didn't have emulation for the CD games um, such as Dragon's Lair and some of these others I missed was missed on the Jaguar I don't know mm. does that mist looks, looks kind of like misty mist. doesn't it, is it? Mist, yeah. yeah so they showed off some of this uh, Jaguar CD games uh, screenshots there and somebody posted this in the forum as mm. well um and he's looking that is missed there mm -hmm. you go what's that cat doing what's he eating oh he's got a twist tie don't let him swallow that um and also uh he's looking for donations because it's a free emulator mm. and he says if there's enough of them enough support he will add in developer and bugger debugger enabled builds so you can check on what's happening with the game which would be a huge mm. huge bonus to jaguar developers Jaguar VR support for Missile Command VR on a modern headset. Oh, okay. So new games that have VR support, being able to play the new games, the new VR Jaguar games. I'm not sure about that. Okay. I don't know what Missile Command VR is. Okay. I mean, I know, I know what it is, but I don't know what it is. And also enhancements to Jaguar games such as control options, higher resolution, or higher frame rate. I'm guessing beyond 
the built-in frame rates and resolutions that were limited on the Jaguar, mm. like taking it beyond, you know, the 480i output, you know. Uh, yeah, same with me, S. Ramirez. I need to find some uh, time to load up the new cores in my analog pocket as well. Mm. I'm falling far behind, but I haven't played it in a while. Um, so, very cool for Jaguar people there. Um, and the uh, fifth anniversary of Zero Page Homebrew <gasps> is tomorrow. What? <laughs> and we're doing a special show tomorrow. Are we? To break out of the... Um, the nominees that we're playing through. So we're okay. doing an extra show tomorrow for okay. everyone who wants to celebrate with us. Five years wow. of Zero Page Homebrew. Wow. We started the show, what day is it tomorrow? On February 9th, wow. 2018. Okay. Yeah, so it's five years tomorrow. Uh, when are we doing that show? Uh, same time, six o'clock. No, yum, it's yum, impossible. Yum. Oh, no. <laughs> late show? It'll be a late show. Oh, <laughs> only for the hardcore. <laughs> I'll have to bake a cake. Yes. Tomorrow. Yes. She'll be at work. Yes. Uh, cats are having fun. Okay, yes, time for treats. Treats for cats. Um, but we will also be playing the full version of... Uh, Rat Trap by Darrow Genther, a brand new Ooh, game, nice. um, which is the arcade game Mouse Trap on the 7800. So we have the exclusive full version of Rat Trap tomorrow. We're playing on the five year anniversary show, which Tammy won't be there for. No, we'll just I'll be it. there. It'll have to be a little later, though. Way late, right? Yeah. 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 We'll figure it out. Oh, boy. <laughs> OK, well, it has to be tomorrow because that's to be tomorrow. the day. You can call in sick. I can call in sick from work. No. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, one Sprite for Sprite. The lead. Oh, I got to switch over to the cat cam. Cat cam. Who triggered the cat cam? Steps. Thank steps, you so thank much. You. Steps. Yeah, anniversary after dark. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we could do that. I think it will have to be. Yes. Yeah. Oh, did he bring it too? He yeah, and he ran off. Okay, one one. One one. Oh, two one for Sprite. Two one. Oh, 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 deceptive. Making him run around. Um, Rat Trap is really good. I can't wait to play. Three, Three one. Yeah, shut that door. Atari took his treat outside. Oh, did he ring it? No. Who who rang it? Did you well, ring he it? He was eating. Oh. Well, yeah, I'll give it to him. One. Three two. Three two. Four two. For Sprite. Big surprise. Five two. Five three for Sprite. Smart, giving it to him first. Well, no, I it, it was around <laughs> he did the ring same it first. time. He accidentally Six, sat on it, that's what I thought. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah, that's Six, okay. Three. He got a bonus one. Oh, harder. Smack so I have it. to subtract one. It's five oh. three. Uh, Smack six it. four now. No, he got it. Did he? He did. I th it, it was didn't at ring. the same time. Oh, okay. Six four. I thought Sprite got it with his tail. Oh. Yeah, I thought so. He 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 butt butt dialed. He butt, <laughs> butt dialed. Butt dinged. Seven four for Sprite. <laughs> butt dinged it. Eight four oh, for Sprite. Oh my goodness, Sprite. Oh. Okay, we're gonna make this harder. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Get it. Good kitty. Oh, oh, right over. Eight five for Sprite. Eight eight five for nine five for Sprite. <laughs> nine six for Sprite. For yeah, for Sprite. Oh. Come on, oh, uh -oh. it's taking a while. I gave him an, an impossible treat. Did it get caught somewhere? Oh, he's catching up. Come on, nine seven for Sprite. It's your opportunity. Oh, is he gonna give up on that treat? He's like, give me your treat. Yeah, I like how Sprite uses multiple bells. And bells. it's game point. Is Sprite going to get it? <gasps> Nine eight for Sprite. Oh, he's catching up. Sprite is befuddled. Sprite, one more. Oh, you're encouraging him. Oh, oh, oh ten. Oh, ten. Good. Ten eight? Ten eight. Ten eight. Good stuff. You could train Sprite to do track and field. And then an extra one for you. Good. Yes, that consolation was a good treat. Double ring. Good kitties. Very good kitties. You train Sprite to do track and field. Very yeah. true. Bang, 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 um, bang. My daughters yep. want me to tell you they really like watching your video. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, thank you, Cuganismo's daughters. Yeah. Thank you for watching. And the cats love, love ringing bells for they you. Do. So. <laughs> yes. Uh, what were the games you played in your very first show? Will you break them out again? Well, oh. That's a very good question. Oh, yes. What were the very first games we played? Let me check. Now, the first show was with Darcy. Yes. Yep. Um, don't watch it. It's terrible. <laughs> I'm sure it's not that bad. The frame rate is like three frames a second. <laughs> it's really terrible. 
Uh, Super Cobra, Ixion, and Spies in the Night. Oh. Yeah. Um, great games. Like, really great game. Combat. Combat. <laughs> no. <laughs> so, um, I think we'll just keep playing new games. We've played those games a bunch. <laughs> Fair Especially enough. Especially Spies in the Night. Yeah. Uh, maybe on the 10th anniversary, we'll go back to those. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, but today... Ixion is a fun one. All three are amazing games. Mm -hmm. Oh, cats need need possible escape. They can get their way out. Oh, that's true. Yeah. There you go. So we're going to start off the show. Uh, did I do all the news? Let me make sure. Oh, no. Okay. So uh, we're on day six of voting. Okay. In the fifth annual Atari Homebrew Awards. Mm. Um, and the votes are up 12.5% since last year on the same oh, day. Oh, really? Because so, I keep track of the votes. And, and how many are coming in. How many are coming in. Very so, nice. yeah. So even more people are participating. Nice. That's based on the highest voted category. Okay. Which makes sense because that's the most number of people. I mean, different people would be voting in different categories. That's true. It's a hard metric to do, mm -hmm. <laughs> but based on that, yeah. Mm. Um, so if you haven't already started voting, make sure you uh, start take, checking out the games or follow along with us. Um, let me just paste it in there. Oh, congratulations on your birthday, hey, Canadian happy tenor. birthday, Canadian tenor. Another it's Canadian. It's ding, 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 treat time for Canadian it's tenor. Treat time. <laughs> yeah, have Ring your cake. that bell. Ring that bell for the cake. <laughs> so if you haven't already started voting, it closes next Friday, not this Friday, mm -hmm. so the 17th. So you still have about a week and a half to go. Okay. Big 44. Yeah. Wow. Congratulations. congratulations. That's a, a very, digits, yeah. very unlucky number in Chinese. Is it? Yes. Oh, wow. It, it Four sounds like death in uh, Chinese. Oh, that's wonderful to, to mention. Thank <laughs> death, you. Death, death. Death, death. But if you make it... Wonderful. If thank you. you, you to, thank you, James. <laughs> if you thank make you. it to 88, <laughs> super lucky if you make it 88. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, okay. Eight super lucky. Oh, okay. There you go. That's my knowledge of Chinese um, numbers. <laughs> Number that's luck. That's numerology. Uh, numerology, yeah. Yeah, you youngin. That uh, that constitutes a young person in this. I actually <laughs> in think this it does. I think it does. It does. <laughs> the cats can't get it open. Or did one escape? No. Okay. Um, so we're gonna uh, start off tonight with Atari Twenty Six Hundred, a homebrew under four K original games. He's befuddled by the door. Oh, befuddled gray cat. So not that hard to get <laughs> so out that door. Needy. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's switch over to the 2600. There's a joystick yeah. for you. Uh, and I'll we'll switch over so we can see it along with them. So if you can go to the fifth awards, as I aptly named it. Fifth awards. And then go to completed and go down to the first one, legendary spear. This is a 2K game uh, by Dave Christensen. Oh, yeah. I love uh, Dave C. Look at that lovely, lovely sunset. And you can see why it was nominated. It, yeah. For a 2K game, the yeah. graphics are stellar. Yeah. Like spectacular for a 2K game. I'm trying to remember this now. It's, it's reminiscent of... of um, oh, yeah. You can't get hit. Stampede. Yes, very reminiscent. Um, it's not. It doesn't have the same gameplay, but the fact you're riding a horse, that's that's about it. <laughs> and there's some rocks that go by that you don't want to touch. And I mean, you're not roping cattle. There's no rope. Uh, they're not. They're not in groups. Yeah. Um, oh, oh, two at oh, once. I didn't know you could do that. Of course, you have to line them up. They have to be lined up, and you have to be in the. What? Oh, you get me from the top. Oh, okay. I don't even know how you did that. I don't. Oh, and I caught him on the edge. Uh, it'd be nice. interesting to see if there's a Twitch channel that skews even older than this one. That would be hard to uh, do. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you got it again. I know. Ah, uh, you got me too fast. It would have to be like a grandma cooking channel or something. Yeah. And even oh, then. Full death. Oh. Full death. Yeah. So, yeah, you're supposed to spear these guys. Um, you get a point. Is that like a mesa at each. the bottom there? Yeah. Is that what you call it? I think so. 
And you get... Oh, interesting. Now, I can't remember what the bar at the top is. It does go down as you get people. What? No, you made it to the next level. Oh! The bar at the top was going down, I think. Because you have 10 points, and if you press the button, no. No, I died. Okay. Maybe you hit hit them. Uh, you can yeah, catch you, edges. That's probably um, it. That's your health bar. There, yeah. that's a perfect one. I think you have to line yourself up. Yeah, yeah. Your health goes down if you're not lined up. Oh, really? Yeah. So oh, that was a good hit. So I'm doing terrible is what you're saying. <laughs> well, you're getting points, but... There, perfect. Uh, okay, yeah. okay, that, that, oh. Tanya finding bugs again. Well. No, no, I don't think it was a bug. It's just, yeah, she took hits for that, so it's not actually a good thing that she hit twice. Oh, I like how Canadian Tenor is saying it is not minus 50 in Regina right now. <laughs> Therefore, it's springtime. Uh, and that's how it works in Canada. <laughs> that's right. If it's not freezing, it's spring. In so February. I have to be comp yeah, there. So that was a perfect hit. Your, your health didn't go down. I'm sure there's some leeway, a little bit of leeway. Uh, Okay. Uh, stay down there. I think they all stay in their own lane. They do. So if you stay exactly at the bottom, you should be able to hit them every time. And if you go, uh, oh, maybe they do move a little sensitive. bit. Oh, that was quick. Oh, that was bad. Yeah. So you can't be too high. Oh my god. <laughs> No, oh, too no, high. Too high. <sighs> it's hard because your spear is down, right? Their spears are up. Mm -hmm. So you don't know where your... I guess you could... It's right at the nose of the horse. Interesting. At the bottom of the nose of the horse. That's how you can line it up. I think that one's just on the bottom. Or you can line up the Bottom hoops. and top are easy to line up. Because they're the same height as you, so you just line your whole horse up. 26. Now that now that uh, we know the rules, a little bit easier. Ugh. Oh, no. Lower is okay. It's too high is the oh, problem. Oh, it's the opposite of joust. <laughs> That's a good way of thinking of it. Yeah. Too low is okay. Too high, death. Mm. Or reduction in health. Ah! Uh, or too slow. Or too slow. <laughs> Right in the nose. One more hit. You're done. Oh my goodness. It's a slight delay from when you push it and when. Oh. Not much of a delay, but enough to, to get you if you're not on, on the ball. I keep seeing Jar Jar riding those steers. <laughs> really? I'm trying to see it. Let's see. See Jar Jar. <laughs> oh, oh, 60. Okay, I was getting the hang of it by that's the end good. there. Lethal boop. <laughs> Lethal boop. Um, so, uh, really amazing game for 2K. Yeah. Let me know if it Very cool. goes out of sync. Ah, oh, sorry. Oh, don't spill it. I'm not um, spill next it. one is Pin Finger. Uh, it's a 4K game. All these are 4K and under. That's by Grocer Games. Uh, Kevin Kelly. Kev Kelly. Mm. Mm. This one freaks me out. <laughs> I know, I know. It's just an Atari approximation of a hand. So in this game, you're, you're playing with a knife and your hand. I think this is kind of hilarious, actually. I, it was we played this before and it's oh, yeah. pretty fun. We played all these games. It just kind of it kind of makes me laugh. What are we drinking tonight? It is it is actually just soda. <laughs> Only it's, soda. It's blueberry lime soda tonight. I've been not sleeping so great lately, so. Um, well, there's a big reason last night for that. Oh gosh, yeah. Um, uh, there was a car with a car alarm going off all night long. I think it started around 9 or 10. It started at 9 or 10 and it would go off for a while then it would come on and then it would start it went started going off again at 1 a.m. And it's like who has a car alarm anymore? <laughs> like they don't even put car alarms in cars. It was awful. It was awful all night long. Uh, let's see. I think it's one player and then we go to 3. <laughs>
Oh, yes, this is the more random movement. Carl G, it's definitely not an overdone game concept. <laughs> oh, this one? No, this is super unique. Yeah. Um, Kev Kelly Hilarious. always does really unique games. Yeah. Hello, real old dude. It's a great name. <laughs> <laughs> that is. Is that uh, in reference to our... our um, no, that's, that's, that's their name. Uh, to our earlier uh, conversation. Maybe, yeah. Somebody made up a new name. Yeah. Well, it fits right in the demographic. Yeah. So obviously this one, you don't want to hit your fingers. Yeah. And you want to get in between your fingers, like in the movie Aliens. <laughs> oh! Hey. Except you're a human and you're hitting a finger that is virtual. Mm. And I believe there's faster settings if you change the difficulty. I'm just going to... Oh, I might need to reset it. Or not. Ow! <laughs> Ooh. No. I would need the manual to look it up. This is basically Homer Simpson. Uh, it's, the, it's the yellow hand. Oh, yeah, it is Homer uh, Simpson's hand. Uh, what do you call this game? What's it called? Yeah, there's a oh, name the for it. the actual name? Yeah. <sighs> I know there's an actual name for it. Knifey Handy. Knifey Handy. <laughs> Uh, so very, very unique. Um, Kev okay. Kelly usually makes games about mundane tasks at work. <laughs> this is kind of a break from the, the things he does, uh, types of games he makes. He did one about, um, he's working on one about stocking shelves. Lovely. Another one, it was uh, operating a, not a forklift, but a manual one. What are okay. those called? Where you move around crates and you put them on it's like a forklift except there's no forklift it's just you moving it around uh what other ones he's done i can't remember you're not helping <laughs> okay next one is raptor 4k by andrew Polly. pallet jack thank you pallet jack five finger fillet oh that's a good name for it uh, uh, if it's not if it's not the real name <laughs> Uh, not listening to me at all. I'm not. I'm really tired. Oh. Uh, what what time? What Raptor. time is it? <laughs> what time is it? Yeah. Raptor. Raptor. So this is Raptor by Andrew Polly, also known as Armscar Coder. Yeah. NTSC, yes. Yeah, my day involved a lot of thinking too, which I think my brain's just oh. fried. So we'll see how the games go. <laughs> <laughs> it's taking all my attention did right now. Did he make a game based on picking up rubbish? Yes. Yes, he did. He did as well. He did Atari 2600, dude. Yeah, he makes really, really very unique games. This is a really nice, nice uh, background to this game. Yes, it's very reminiscent ah. of Activision games. There is a bomb, isn't there? Uh, double tap. This is not the right setting for the retro tank. For the, oh, is it flashing or? No, you can see things get set back every once in a while. Like the frames go out of order, like there. Oh gosh, this is killing me today. Oh, ah! thank you for cheering, real old dude. Remember, you have the bomb. I know, I keep forgetting. You said it's double tap. Yeah. There we go. Yep. Okay, just. Just testing. Glad you're enjoying the show. Oh, Mr. Zarnwoop, the exactly correct. Uh, this would have made a great Activision game back in the day. An Atari 2600 dude reminded us that 1K points equals the patch. Uh -huh. Go for it. It's not going to happen. You can do it. But, uh... Ah! Oh, no! Got tagged. Get him. How do I... Ah! Oh! How do I... No, all you have to do is avoid that square. There you go. There you go, you're invincible. Hold down the button. Clear the board. Let go. There. You go. So yeah, if you hold down the button too long, there's an overheating meter. Yeah, it'll red flash. on the bottom. Uh, getting the blue it has a funky name. Can't remember what it is. Something to do with blue. Um, gives you invincibility in yeah. this game. You're able to shoot as much as you want without overheating. Uh, there's also a radar. Um, no! 
That's the worst dude there. Ah, oh, he speeds up. <laughs> There's a guy with a radar that'll take out your um, aiming. So it makes it a little bit harder till you get... Oh, oh now there's a floaty that. now. Nice. Yeah. Oh, now you got that in the sky at all times. Extra difficulty. What? Oh, overheated. Held it down too long. Oh, good move. Good move. Ah, uh, this, this thing is uh, a oh problem. No. I think that's your think last one. I think you're right. Oh, see? Radar. Oh, come on. Yeah, you have to stay away from that edge. No! Oh, we, we got gotta... one left. Oh, no. It's you not only get well. so many um, vehicles that can escape off the right-hand side. Oh, oh. oh no! no! Oh, no! Oh, no! 192. I've done much better than that, yes. but anyway. You got a... <laughs> you got a crab award. Crab rule. <laughs> you are part of the crabs. A crab. Is that a lobster? No, I think it's a crab. It's a crab. It's got little fins or something. Okay. Okay. Uh, next one is mm. spiders and flies. Mm. I'm going to switch this over to a different one. Oh, no. James and Henry are definitely out of sync audio video. We are? We are. Don't tell us that. No. The camera is lagging behind the game. Well, that's, 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 that's different. Hmm. Is it? Are we out of sync of our mouths or are we out of sync of the game? Anyway. Have to be very specific. It's just about half a second. Oh. Well, us out of sync of the game is not too bad. Mm. Us out of sync of our mouths is very bad. Yeah. Seems to be fine, says Cubanismo. <laughs> well, yeah, you might want to restart your stream. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, Spider, Spiders and Flies by Game Select. Ricardo Pim. Um, design, development, gameplay, instructions, manual, text. Everaldo Bonif Bonifacio, gameplay, and Solo Santiago, illustrations and art. I hear your voice before I see your mouth move. Oh, that's interesting. Really? Is it still that way right now? <laughs> Okay, Prow says it's fine. Smoked, restart your uh, stream. Just refresh. Mm. That's the manual. Manual. Guessing game. There you go. Press button. So I think it's just a straight up shooter. Shoot, 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 and shoot the big spider at the top. Yeah. Oh, you can let them go by. Can you? Yeah. There you go. And the spider comes down unless you shoot it back up to the top. And those just kind of get in the way. Mm -hmm. Fine here. I, Ivory Tower says I see the same delay. Some people it's fine, some it's mm. not. That is very strange. I think people need to restart if they're having trouble. And I'm going to go out of the room and watch the stream. If okay. Tanya can talk. Uh, I'll try to talk. <laughs> um, creepy spiders. Uh, I don't know what to say. It's hard. I can't watch the chat and play the game at the same time. <laughs> well, <laughs> where are my cats right now? You know, if there was a cat playing this game, they'd be, they'd do very, very well. The cats do really like to chase insects and spiders, so... Um, I'm not getting many points, because you really only get points by hitting the little ba baby spiders that are coming down, so... No, sync is fine. Restart your stream if you're having trouble. <laughs> you guys... Make oh. me crazy. But I do ah. like it when you tell me, because it might actually well, be a problem when I... Well, you do want to troubleshoot if there is a, an issue there. 100%. I'm still chatting. <laughs> still chatting away in the background. Maybe I should pause that. There you go. I think the game sound and the game video is in sync, but they aren't. Oh, it's not her talking. It's the sound of her pushing the button that's ahead of the game. Oh, oh. my god. 
you need to be very specific. Yeah. <laughs> Saying something is out of sync could be a million things. Yeah. Um, that is not the worst thing in the world, her being out of sync with the game. It's annoying, but it's not the Ow. worst. Can you make the stream in uh, cornflower blue? <laughs> Hey, thanks. <laughs> it's not obvious while Tanya's playing because there's a lot of button presses. True. Yeah, and I smack it really hard. <laughs> smack. Smack, smack, smack. <laughs> it's, 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 an, it's a, an analog button, so the harder she presses it, the faster the bullet goes. Yes, yes. It does not work that way. Yes, it does. <laughs> On uh, modern does. consoles, uh, the shoulder buttons would work that way. Really? Yeah, because they... Did see, that I just learned something some today. Some shoulder buttons, I believe, are analog. Oh. Um, the buttons on the controller are digital. Um, thumbsticks are analog because you, you move them in. Hit these. Oh, for some reason I didn't think you could. I thought they were impenetrable. Ah, get well, those. I'm not getting egg any sacks. points. <laughs> get those egg sacks. The PS2 nice. face buttons were analog. Really? Wow. Do I have any PS2 button? Yeah, I have, I have some PS2 controllers. I'll have to take a look at those. It's a fun game. There used to be analog arcade buttons. Really? I wonder which games had that. Analog? Because I can see it being useful for some games. Is like, oh, oh my god, he's coming after you. Uh, now they're moving. Where ah. if you like, say, a boxing game, and the harder you push the button, um, the harder it hits. I think this is the end. Yep, you died. Okay. Okay. Um, PS buttons are pressure sensitive. Wow. Ah, th yeah, things to learn, things to learn. The PS2 face buttons were analog. Mm. Mm. Didn't the original Street Fighter, not two, and may have had analog buttons? How do you press the heart of your character? Punched or kicked? Wow. Uh, the next game we're going to be playing is mm. Vroom. Oh, yeah, nice. Which uses different controllers uses paddle controllers. Mm -hmm. uh, we're not going to plug in the uh, Quadtari because there's only two people here. Yeah. But we could get the cats game, involved, but... Uh... We could. <laughs> <laughs> but this game can support up to eight players with eight paddles mm. using the Quadtari. Mm. So Ready. one of these should work. Mm -hmm. Turn it all the way. No? Okay. Maybe not. Oh, oh my god. No, oh, are you turning it? No. Nope. Oh, there we go. It is my controller. Or not. There we go. Duh! Duh! Can I get it with this? Maybe I'll have to unplug them. Duh! Mm. Oh! Wait, no! Come on, just a little bit up, just a <laughs> tiny. Oh, 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 oh! No! <laughs> I'm gonna have to unplug them. <laughs> You're being very naughty. The game is getting the game to start. <laughs> That's right. Ready. What oh, is it? Kittens. Are you ready for round two of treats? Is that what you're saying? Can't have them yet. No. Oh, kid. Oh. Okay. This is by uh, Thomas Yench, and uh, Corey Kramer did the packaging artwork for the uh, physical release. Why is this all tied up? That's not going to help. We're like tethered to each other. Yeah, it's way too tethered. Oh, why is that there? That should be there. There we go. Okay, so I am. Don't know what I am. Press button? No. I think I have to restart. I think it anyway. I think it cycles. There we go. I'm blue? I don't know what I am actually. Nope. Yellow. I'm blue. You have to press when you're on the arrows and let go when you're not on the arrows. So now we're playing two. Oh. Yeah. I, I oh, weirdly that's why. I think Oh well. I'm controlling yellow and blue, but I'm controlling yellow. I'm controlling blue. You're controlling blue? Yep. Oh, okay, then I'm really I think, confused. I think we pressed them at the exact same time and we're confused. So we will do it separately this time. 
I think I was yellow. <laughs> but then there was white and purple. Yeah. Okay, let's try this again. You press. Press. Okay, you're yellow. I'm yeah, blue and, and gray. Purple. Oh, you're gray as well? Yeah, looks like I'm too. Oh, I'm... You're blue. Blue and purple. I'm blue. This makes me really dizzy after a while. <laughs> it's a really cool game. Yeah. Great graphics, great sound. Amazing what has been packed into 4K. What were, what were you? Which one? Yellow. Oh, nice. Second place. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Oh, without the quad tire, each paddle will pick two cars. So this okay, is specifically that's that's nice. I like that. made for the quad tire. Because I don't think I've ever played it without the quad tire. That's tari. true. I don't think we have. So I've never noticed that. Mm. Well, the cars... Let me take a look at that again. The arrows are off the screen. The cars uh, would be drawn with the... Um, well, they're all in their own line. That's a good question. I because there's up to five arrows. The cars are definitely oh, maybe not. That's a very good question. I don't think I've ever looked at it under Stella to, to figure that out. Because the cars could be drawn with many things. Because they're all there's just a car and arrows on the same line. Hmm. What's that cat up to? I don't know. He's disappeared. Hold on. Give me one quick second. Uh, uh, hey. Is he, into, is he chewing paper? No, he's just like hanging out in the storage space. No, that's the problem with cats. As soon as you go over to see what they're doing, they're like, I'm not doing anything. Yeah. I'm, I'm just a good chilling. cat. I'm just sitting here. I'm not doing anything. Each arrow is a bit of a wide player. Uh -huh. uh, oh, is it? So it's like super stretched out. What are the cars? Oh, is the car made of a player and the arrows made of another player? That makes sense. They're like super, super, super wide mm -hmm. players. Okay. Very, very fun game. Uh, excellent graphics mm -hmm. and sound. Um, then we're going to move on to Zero Page Homebrew the Game. Starting automatically. And this one is a joystick, and it is specifically two players. You cannot play with one player. No, nope. it's a two player game. It won't be a very fun game with one player. <laughs> <laughs> so, find a friend, dial a friend. There we go. If you can load it up, please. I don't think there's any more paddle games, but I'll keep them around just in case. Zero page homebrew the game? Yes. Nice. I had nothing to do with this game, <laughs> except I'm in it. Yes. Uh, this is made by Le Leandro Camera, yes. HSW3ET. Mm -hmm. um, you get to play as cats, you get to play as people, us, yep. Darcy, Erlen, Tanya, myself. That's correct. Um, and um, Pixel is the big boss <laughs> that yeah. you get to fight every second round. Mm -hmm. Ah, the cats. Yes. Okay, so let's uh, pick our characters. We'll I have to play them. cat. I have to. Okay, I am that. So you're playing me. So let's see. Play cat. You need to play an Atari. Okay, I'm going to play Atari. Okay. Ready? So I have to get the balls. You have to get them. I have to catch you, right? Yeah, catch me. Yeah. And if you get hit by the ball, you get reset. I'm not very good at this. Ah! <laughs> I feel like you're very slow, by the way. Look at that floppy blonde you? hair. Me in the game or yeah. me playing? Yeah, me in the game. Okay. You in the game. Oh, such a slow walker. <laughs> well, the cats are fast. So cute when he stops too. Atari cat, yeah. so cute. Yeah, he rests when he stops. He's so cute. Uh, very good graphics in this game. Very colorful. And very cute. Uh, 
am dominating. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's bonus round. I can't remember. You have to catch me or I have to catch you. You have to catch me six times. That's one. But every time you catch me, I get more health. Of course, my health set back. So it doesn't matter. I think it's 30 seconds long. I'm a fast, fast pixel. Now, if I get you this time... Oh, oh no! <laughs> you got all your health back. Yep. So, the object of the game is to... Catch me so you can bring me to the show, because the show's late. And <laughs> the object for me is to catch as many cat toys as possible to play with for the yeah. cats. Oh. You're unscrewing the thing yeah, again? Yeah, I'm always unscrewing the thing. <laughs> Just turns. Oh my gosh. He, James is very good at this game, by the way. <laughs> I'm, meow, I'm meow, for meow, some meow, reason, meow, have meow, such meow. a hard time catching. Meow, 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 catching meow. the cats. Ah. <laughs> meow, 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 meow. <laughs> meow, 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 meow. <laughs> meow, 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 meow. Who meow, doesn't meow. like a game with fluffy cats in it? More games need cats. No? I have all the health I need, so it's up to you to catch them. That's, that's true, actually. Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> You can't catch me. I'm a fast pixel cat. <laughs> oh. Time again. Like, literally, you have to catch me or the game will never end. I know. It just keeps going on indefinitely. <laughs> of course, I'm yeah, playing I find the... I really hard. I'm playing the smallest character. Yeah, which is the hardest which to catch. Which is the hardest. But you had, I had to get you. We don't have to play this indefinitely. No. Um, yeah, I have to play the cat. So if you catch me, you see the health goes down. Yeah. I'll just give you some. Well, no, it's okay. Fighting chance. That's okay. <laughs> Aw. Pet the kitty. Come pet the kitty. Pet the kitty. Yay. That's <laughs> so cute. We'll play up to. Um, 68 points. Oh, I'm in the yellow now. Yeah. One more! Game point! Oh! There, you can get me. Catch, catch the, catch the pixel. Catch. Come pet the cat! <laughs> Pet the kitty. Aww. Two more. One more kitty. There we there go. There we go. Should draw add a drop of thread locker to the ball knob. Oh, oh yeah, I'm I'm bad. I don't really want it on there permanently because to take it apart you need yeah, that's true. to take off the ball. So very cute game in my biased opinion. Because <laughs> <laughs> it has cats. Has our cats in it. But did you charge royalties for your likenesses? No, but I think the cat yep. should. Zero percent. Yeah. <laughs> Zero percent royalties. They should charge in cat treats. Cat really. treats. Yeah, yeah, the cats need to be paid. Yeah. Uh, now we're going to move on to under 4K ports. And the first one is Apple Slayer uh, 4K port, if you could load it up. Mm -hmm. Um, by I don't know who, because uh, they were a student in the Atariando class of July oh, 2022. Very nice. Apple Slayer. So this is a port of Fruit Ninja. So you oh. have to cut some apples. Very nice title screen. Yeah. Oh, it's got a tree for a background. What? I think you have to press the button. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I think it's a horizontal slice, so... Does it always go to the right? Yeah. Okay, so you have to be on the left of it. There you go. Slice, slice. Oh, ah. the, or does it go back and forth? No. No, just to the right. You have to reset it. Or you can be on it, too. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, when the apples get to the bottom. 
Well, now it's faster. Oh, <gasps> game over. It's a short that game. was terrible. Let me play. <laughs> oh, good night, Esmeralds. Oh, I have to reset it. Manuali. Oh, that's just a nice graphic. Yeah, it's very nice. Slice. Slice. Yeah, it's not hard once you get used to it, but. And if I remember correctly, it was a class, and as their uh, graduating thing, they had to make a project oh. to make a game. As, oh, that's very cool. I believe it's using um, Batari Basic. Ah, oh my god, where'd my thing go? <laughs> How cool would it be to get to program an Atari game for a class? I oh, agree. Super How much cool. fun. Yeah. Ah. Oh, when you're in a fully on the right-hand side, it doesn't quite move correctly. Ah! Oh, it's getting fast now. No! Yeah, when you're on the right-hand side, you have to move all the way to the right, or it doesn't move. Nope! Oh, I got it, just in time. No! Oh! You did just get it, wow. I do like that there's a slight pause when it gets yeah. slashed, so you get your bearings a bit. Get to see it and reset a bit, yeah. I wonder if there's another level of speed. I don't think so. So far, nothing. I like it. It's simple. Ah! No! Oh, no! Oh, oh no. no! Now they're really going no, fast. Oh, it's now I'm going on the right hand side oh oh one more no ah! oh. <laughs> super fun very cool uh like next one is I like Ein, Ein Vader um uh, by Owen Cooper okay Coop Devil who turned up the gravity exactly that's right <laughs> Ein what did you say Ein Vader Ein, Ein Vader. Vader Bin yes the BAS is the uh, like manual? the code. Oh, the code in basic. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay, I don't know this game. Oh. I think it's Space Invaders. Uh, -huh. uh, kind of. Yeah, things are going across the screen. Got to shoot the thing. They get lower and lower. Oh, I don't control anything. Just the shot. Oh. Your guy goes back and forth. It. Oh, we can't get it there. Some. Oh, you move in the opposite direction when you press fire. So you can turn around. Uh -oh. oh my god. It gets close to the bottom, it gets hectic. So not only is there timing vertically, there's timing horizontally because you don't control. Oh, now it's fast. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Makes it very urgent, the colors when they... Uh, when they change. Ein equals one, one Vader. Interesting. Oh, okay. Ah. Oof. Saving yourself. Oh my gosh, Very this lesson. is hard. <laughs> this is really hard. You don't get any bullet recalls, do you? Ah, I want a recall. <laughs> that would be good to have a bullet recall. Because if you miss, you have to wait for your bullet to go off the screen. It sped up. It's sped up since it started. Yeah. You almost have to plan it before it's on the screen now. Wow. You actually want to stay to the far edge there. Oh yes. Well, it's easier to calculate. I'm getting like lucky. I'm just <laughs> shooting. <laughs> Well, because it's fast and your bullet is slow, that actually increases the chance of it getting hit. And I've noticed that in some games, it, it's hard to begin with, but it kind of gets easier. But you don't, but you don't get as much time overall to hit it. It's like having a laser the length of the screen; it's going to hit it. But the laser is the length of that. But it stays on the line for so long. Vader also means black. Twenty six hundred. Very true. Port of one Vader. Yes. Uh oh. 
No, no. Oh, that was a pretty good run, actually. <laughs> game under. Oh. Or is that game Vader? Game over. No, it's not game over. Uh, game under? Game under? Game Vader. Game Vader? I think it's Game Vader. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Well, over and under would be the pun. So I think it's under. I think it's Game Vader. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You can interpret it either way. Game to the Vader. <laughs> <laughs> uh, next one is another Invaders type game. Oh. It is Invaders from Andromeda oh. uh, by Carmelo Cisano. Cisano. this what is this i see it is a black screen or a gray screen now it's a black screen and it's an ovidia screen <laughs> oh my goodness what oh, is go. happening half a port really individual in the in original the invader moved to the right then the left oh, okay mm. i am going to see why this is blinking being the blinking thing um Port of one Vader. Oh, okay. Invader. Oh, it's a zip file and I didn't unzip it. That that I happens. I swear that I unzipped happens. all of them. <laughs> I swear I did. There's a lot there. Maybe I just looked at it and went, oh yeah, it's the NTSC. It's mm. fine. Luckily it's easy to do. Well, if anyone has some extra treat money. Treat money. Now's the time to do it. Yeah. Oh, no, you just picked the wrong one. Zip files are so 1990s, says Phaser Cat Games. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're handy if you have, like, instructions and, like, multiple things that you want to put all together and not... And graphics. Mm. So they're not a bunch of files. It's just easier to distribute. There you go. I deleted everything but the bin in the folder. Excellent. That should make it a lot easier. Mm -hmm. While we play, or while you play, I'll tell you a story about my mm. controller. How do I go back again? Uh, that. Just press it. Okay. Nope. Oh, Invaders from Andromeda. Okay. I clicked on Invader again, I think. Uh -huh. This one? Yep. There we go. Okay. I'm halfway there. Can I get five treats instead of ten? Oh. Doesn't work that way, unfortunately. <laughs> Start it up. Oh, there we go. So, Space Invaders, except they fall down. It's kind of like Tetris ah! Invaders. Really nice colorful graphics in this one. Um, a scrolling Earth at the bottom. It's got the UFO at the top. Oh, oh, almost got the UFO. Um, so, the links that I just got, um, it's kind of consoleized, so you can plug an external controller into the links. And the external controller it's wired for is the Sega Master System because it's a very, very simple controller. It's straight like, is that pin grounded? Yes, that, that, that direction is being pressed. That's how easy this uh, controller is. Um, and we played on the show a little while back. We had a Lynx day. And then I went to use it the other day and the left direction didn't work anymore. And I was like, oh my god, my the, the Lynx is broken again. I was freaking out. And oh, you have multiple shields. That's what's going on. That's why you're getting hit and not dying. Oh, Am just I? missed the UFO. Yeah, it's like lives. Ugh. No recall on this one either. Oh, it's awful. <laughs> Oh, zero shield. It's a lot of shooting on this one. Oh, no video. Well, oh, no! <laughs> give Sanya a chance, chance to play it again. Can we please see, says Dan, ABC. Please, please. You, have to, you have to feed the cats. Yes, we're not seeing the game. James is providing descriptive audio <laughs> for the visual impaired. There you go. Sorry, people. <laughs> now, don't you want a full story about my controller instead of the game? <laughs> okay, go ahead. Now she's what's playing your, for real. What's your full story about the controller? Um, so I unplugged the controller and used the keypad on the links and I was like, and it worked. 
Um, so I thought at that point it was the it was the adapter that can, that, um, that I plug it into that has magnetized base to it. And I was like, oh god, I'm gonna have to open up the adapter and and um, fix that. But I did a continuity test through the adapter, and all the pins were perfect. They went all the way through, so it wasn't the adapter, thank goodness. Um, it could have been the internal wiring in the links at that point, or the controller. And I only have one Sega Master System controller, I think. So I was like, okay, well, the easier thing to test out is the Sega Master System controller. Oh, it's party time! <laughs> this little black cat Wait, just hey, jumped out of nowhere. Kittens. Cats, cats. Cats, cats, cats. Tar, you're so slow to come down. You're wandering it in. Wandering in. It's party time for kittens. Cats, cats, cats. Meow, meow, meow. Yeah, party time. Thanks to Rendered Ghost. Thank, thank you, you Rendered, Rendered Ghost. Ghost. The cat's oh, safe. Thank you. Way too much. Ah. There we go. There's some catnip for bad cats. Catnip for bad kitties. Oh, one more to go. Oh, oh, close. Um, so I did a um, kind of a, a continuity test on the controller where I would plug it into the ground and then plug it into each of the pins. And the left did not function at all on the controller. So I knew it was the controller at that point. And I actually tested a bunch of the other ports, as uh, other pins as well. They were really bad. Some of them were like off and on and you had to press it in the exact right position. So I opened it up, or tried to open it up. Two of the pin, two of the screws were stripped. Uh, one I couldn't even get out. The other one I had to get out with, um, it, it came out enough that I could um, use some pliers and unscrew it that way. But there's still one in here that I couldn't get out. Oh, you tipped it all over yourself. He's rubbing his face oh in it. Oh my god, cat. Did he have any? Oh, I think he had a bed at the beginning. Look at him, he's rolling around. Look at this sprite Look guy. Look at this little black kitten. Oh, let's go big on that cat. This is the first time he's like fully indulged in it. He's, he's covered in it. Yeah. Oh my god, cat. You're covered in catnip. <laughs> he's in Nirvana right now. Cat Vana. Cat Vana. Hey, Grey Cat, did you have any? He's like, I'm gonna leave it to the new cat. Oh. Use part of a rubber band, a thin cloth between the screw and the screwdriver on the strip screws. To... Yeah, I did. Yeah. I did try that. Um, I've got the elastic over there. Oh, actually, I threw it away. It it didn't work. It usually does work, but it didn't work that time. Mm. I'm gonna have to get this screw out somehow. But luckily, I was able to get it out enough that I could hinge it on ah. it and twist it mm. and uh, I cleaned off all the um, catnip patches <laughs> the carbon pads and I did a clean on the uh, traces the metal traces on the on the oh yes PCB yes. yeah um, and then I tested it and it worked great mm. so it's back to normal mm. back to terrible Instead of non-working. <laughs> yeah, but it's working. It's it's working normally. You want a shot? Terrible. No, no, no. Okay. We're going to move on. Okay. Uh, next one is It's Connor Time. Uh, 4K port by Cernosoft. Oh. There we go. Catnip patches. Yeah, he needs catnip patch. For when he's jonesing for some catnip. Yeah, first one. So uh, it's Connor Time 2600. So I think you press the button, or just you just go to the right to start the game, which is kind of cool that you run to start the game. So this is um, a port of sorts of um, Smurfs. If anybody recognizes oh. the the little fence you have to jump over, and you also you'll also recognize. Um, Hi. the end of the level as well where you uh, rescue Smurfette. Retro Game Boys makes a good replacement. I've ordered a few clients then I further modified with a remote pause button for the SMS use. Ah, nice. Is uh, the Retro Game Boys one a joystick 
or is it a uh, gamepad? Because I want to get one that's a joystick to replace it. And I may just like rewire um, one. Oh, NES style. Well, it doesn't ah. doesn't give much of a advantage then. I'm not I'm not a big fan of game pads in general. They're good for some games, but for most of the games that we play in the show, I find that a joystick is more appropriate. Ah. <laughs> There's no lives in this game. I oh, think. really? Yeah, you just oh, it's keep funny. going. And there's also a spider in the um, in the Smurfs game too. <laughs> oh come it's on! It's more of like a, a kids game because you don't yeah, have you don't cute. have any lives. You just keep trying. <laughs> there's an actual joystick like the controller for the SMS that Sega officially released, but the joystick on the right side and the buttons in the left. Oh yes, I did see that one. They're not super cheap. Um, that would, and it's also like a gear shift style as well. Doesn't look great. I may just go for this style of um, Bratwurst and do my own rewiring um, because it's just like the wiring on uh, Sega Master System controllers are super straightforward. Like it's just literally ground the pin and you're good. Straight through pin. So it, I would just take like um, a bratwurst and strip it out. Or an alternative is I would have kind of a translator between say the 7800 joystick, because it has two buttons, if it's possible. Now there might be some special things here going on with this, because I haven't looked into how the 7800 is wired compared to a Sega Master system, but like make an in-between um, male to female adapter um, so that the pins would re uh, work correctly. The top of that joystick is a bit bigger than I'd like, but I think it could be changed out. Oh, okay, that's an alternative. Because buying one of those used would be definitely cheaper than buying a new Bratwurst type. It feels like I've wrapped around. <laughs> yeah, I think you've done it, didn't the whole thing. Yeah. I think when you get cute. to the two. Very cute fences that's yeah. like the end the end yeah. okay so that is it's all the oh, 4k is this and oh is that different, different? Oh, okay feels different yeah oh, a little different no oh, not at the end i mean kind of the same but more but more of more, the same more of the same um next one uh next category is atari 2600 graphics original mm -hmm. now we have played some of these so the nominees uh, for that are Grizzards, which we played last show. Okay. Uh, Legendary Spear, which we already played today. Uzi the Goose Slime Quest, which we already played last show. Raptor, which we played today. Uh, Razor's Edge, which we played uh, last show. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Zark, Stars, Zark Stars 2 Ground Force. Okay. Which I don't think there is a demo for. Zark Stars 2? Um, I think there's only video. Let me just confirm that. We we have Zark Stars a version, just we not do, the demo but we version. We can't play that. Oh. We have to play what people are able to play, or but view. we don't have the equivalent to it, or no. Uh, we can't. We can't do that. It's okay. not. It's not really fair to to show that. Uh, so let me just confirm. Because we have to do what, what yeah. they're doing. No, no, no. Um, we've been playing the exact binaries that they have out there. Mm. So this is 2600 Graphics Original. Let me take a look at the information that we have. Yes, there's no public binary. So we're just going to show uh, the video for that. Okay. Mm. Ah, stop, 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 stop playing. <laughs> stop playing. Okay. I don't think there's any sound in this game, so I don't need to switch it out. There we go. I'll have to read that in a second. Okay, so let's go back to the zoned out cat <laughs> for a second. Oh, zoning kitty. Oh, he's, oh, all he's zoned very out. high. Super zoned oh. out. Okay, so let's play this video. It's just 28 seconds long. 
YouTube. complain again there you go <laughs> so this is their promo video for zark stars mm -hmm. um to zark stars 2 to give uh, everybody kind of a, an idea mm. because in for the competition if there's not a binary the next best thing is to show um example gameplay yeah. of, of the game and this is their video that they supplied so it's always best uh, i always go with their video yeah fair enough go so that's their video and for people who have the game it is released so you can uh, play it play it yourself mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay uh, the next category is Atari 2600 graphics port mm -hmm. and we played all of them already already <laughs> uh, last show okay uh, or this show uh, Gorf Arcade Invaders from Andromeda which yep. we played today Load Runner which yep. we played last show Kicks last show. last show Ruby Q last show and Stratavox last nice. show and the next category is Atari 2600 Music and Sound. Mm -hmm. uh, Grizzards. Again, played last show. <laughs> it was the Goo last show. Mm -hmm. Orbital War last show. Raptor this show. Mm -hmm. uh, Razor's Edge last show. Last show. And Space Pac-Man, which we haven't played Space yet. Space Pac-Man. Uh, by Game Select. Excellent. Let's load that up. And I'll switch it over so everyone can see. Uh, so this is by uh, Game Select, Ricardo Pim uh, for concept and programming, and Wilson uh, Gutierrez for assembly code and production. And there it is on the screen. There we go. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, there, there go. we go. And some beta testers as well. Okay. Oh. Uh, maybe press the button. Let's get past that. Hey, Ricardo! Hey, Ricardo Pim is in the chat, the developer of this game. Congratulations on the nomination yes. of the game. Let's get to put Pac-Man in space. Let's do it. Losing health. Oh, right. There you go. What do I have to do? Get the pellets. Get the pellets. Get it. Get those pellets. Get those pellets. Get them. Get them. Get them. Get them. Get them. Oh, and the big pellet. Go up. Press up. There you go. Up, 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 up. There you go. Because your health goes down as that happens. Oh, no. Oh, yes, okay. that's right. Get Move your way out of it. There you go. Oh, you've escaped. The space ghosts are after you. What am I doing? Run away. Oh. Run away. They're after you. Okay, so you want it. Oh! Oh, stay away from them. Don't press the button because it uses up your health That's and right. it warps you. It's only in emergencies. So you have to eat all those I've, pellets. I'm like, it's all come back to me now. I know, now. we haven't played it in a while. Um, that gives you health. And you're very low in health because yeah. you accidentally hit. And stay out of that beam. There you go. And Burning up in the atmosphere he is. Yep, he's going down to Earth. Oh, I have terrible health. I don't think we ever made it down to Earth. It's it's challenging. It gets really challenging. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're probably gonna have to play it again. Uh oh. Uh oh. The alert. Oh no. Dead. Oh, dead Pac-Man. Did you get another chance? Oh, big Kay. cross in the eyes. I really love the audacity it takes to make a Pac-Man game with yeah. no maze, but it works. It yeah, does. it really does. I love, I love that you've got the tunes, yeah. Pac-Man tunes going on there. And the fact that you can... The fact that you're losing life while... Mm -hmm. The kind of video, interactive video is playing is very interesting. Yeah. See, now you have wings. Just, 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 Space! Oh, good night, ITC. Ah! Uh, why didn't that eat? You have to eat it with your mouth at the top. Ah! ah! Ghosts! Free form! They're running around free! It's wrong. It's just wrong. There is a song by a local band. The band's called 
uh, Darkest oh. of the Hillside Thickets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they have a song called Space Ghosts. Ugh. It's a very good song. <laughs> oh, your health. Oh, no! That was completely Invisible. unfair. Space Ghost, the huge Space Ghost. Remember? Oh, oh, there's a good one. No, Get no. it! Oh, yes! Eat those ghosts. Eat them. Eat them. Eat them up good. Nice. Then they get really mad. Oh, super mad. Oh, oh, get that one. Nice. Oh, bonus. Get them all. Replenish health. Replenish the health. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 nom. Great variety uh, in this game. It uh, is so cool. This, Ricardo. And this is good job. nominated for uh, music and sound original and has very good music and sound. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. oh, all, all your life. Me. All your life. They come after you more and more, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, it, it depends. If you get close to them, they attack you. They do. They do go for so you. You want to stay. They kind of drift towards you if you're in. Ah! <laughs> so they kind of get a. Ah! Oh, no! Oh, that's such a good game. Um, and since this is the last game mm -hmm. of the night that we're playing, I'm going to play it. Yeah. I need to read that information from ITC about ITC. joysticks. Or if you out? can read it to me, because okay. it'll probably be helpful in my quest to have a arcade style joystick. The top of that joystick is a bit bigger than I'd like, but I think it can be changed okay. at that side now. Now, I don't think it will work on the actual SMS. I should test this, but the game Montezuma's Revenge on the SMS through the power base converter doesn't work with Genesis controllers. Right. But I actually played the game using my 7800 controllers on the Genesis with a power base converter without modification. Oh. And for Monty Z's Revenge, it would work for both buttons properly. So odd. Oh. Did not understand any of that. <laughs> it's okay, I did. Ah! Ah, that's cheaty. I was. It went right over top of me. <sighs> it's so cute. So I don't know cute. what it is. I just it's I the love little, the, it. It's the Pac-Man. It's the little alien pa uh, ghosts, too. They have little ears. It's the little tongue in his mouth. It he, is! That's what makes it. Ah, ah! Ah! No! I wanted that. Oh, I need a power up badly. Oh, yes. Thank you. Oh, yum, yum, and yum. Run away. Because I turned mad really quick after. Oh, and now it's time. Oh, God! Oh no, my life is almost dead now. Oh, it's the risk. Oh, I made it to the next checkpoint. Yeah, but you're about to die. Yes, I am. I need to get every single one of these. Oh, you're down to nothing. Ah! Every single one of these. Or you're not going to live. Yeah. Yep. I need to make it to the next power up or I'm going to die. Oh. oh. One more. One more. You can scroll back down. One more. Is that the news? I don't think that's the news. What, well, my newest set? What? No, that... Uh, that's the newest. Is it? Okay. And at the bottom. Okay. Oh, okay. there we go. Oh, no. So it's not at the bottom. No. Good night, Ivory Tower! Oh, I already said it. Good night. That's a long way. Oh, but what's going on then? No, no. No, no, that's the bottom. Okay, good. Let me second guess it. Yeah. It's all good. Ah! Oh my god, you really have to stay away from those ghosts. Oh my god. Uh, it's not worth hi. going through the ghosts to get those. Hi, you're very dirty. You're covered in catnip. It says, I'm so hot. Oh my god. I'm so hot <laughs> right now. <laughs> oh, sweetie cat. Don't forget to bring a towel. <laughs> <laughs> Got to get a tally reference in there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, you're so cute. Ah, it's oh! all right on top of me. Oh my goodness, it's it's a, it's a challenge. Very very cool and unique. Sprite is still out. That must have been some really good catnip. Yeah. Oh, he's waking up now. He's yeah. coming. Hi, baby. It's a quick hi. Yeah. Um. So <laughs> next 
<laughs> the next category is Atari 2600 Music and Sound for Port. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he moved as soon as I said that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, and the nominees are Gorf Arcade. Yep. Which we played a last show. Mm -hmm. Invaders from Andromeda mm -hmm. played today. Load Runner last show. Kicks last show. Last show. Ruby Q, last show, and Word Guess, last show. So congratulations yes. to all of the games uh, that were nominated. Cheech and Chong Cats. Um, oh, we're really early. Oh, well, yeah, they're quick play. We played, we quick played a lot of them before, yeah. yeah. Um, Should have had that uh, fifth anniversary cake today. <laughs> that's right, but it's tomorrow. Oh, no. It's tomorrow. I know. We'll do it tomorrow. Yeah. There'll be a little uh, little session in the evening. Yeah. So that is uh, the games for today. Yeah. And it's a short show. <laughs> it is. I, I thought I had enough, but uh, yeah, we played through them pretty quick. Well, we didn't we didn't do super long playthroughs. So, no, and that's yeah. not the point of this. It's just mm -hmm. to kind of refresh our memories and everybody else's memories yeah. out there of the games. Um, so tomorrow's show is zph's fifth anniversary Yay. uh we're going to be playing rat trap an exclusive full uh work in progress version yep and a bunch of other games that are to be announced we could play some word guests together true yes <laughs> yes we've, we've already we're, played it yes we could play some word guests do you want to play some word guests sure. we'll, we'll uh give give your announcements and we'll play a okay. couple of round of words, word guests Together. before we, as a group, yes. um, um, just to end end off the yeah. the stream. I think that's fun. Yeah, we'll yeah. do we'll do three three rounds. Yeah, and, and it's it's audience partic participation because we're neither of us are very good at that game. So <laughs> no, we don't play Wordle. Um, so yeah, we did all these today. Lots of categories, um, and then the next play through, we're going to be mm -hmm. doing the work in progress games, which we've played none of. So that'll be 12 games. I might add another category to that, maybe packaging. Okay. Because packaging, you don't play games. Mm -hmm. um, and maybe something else. Maybe we'll start the 7800 homebrew. Not sure, because we have to pack a lot. Okay. Because there's only so many shows left before the... Yeah, uh, you want to make sure you cover everything off. Right? Yeah, with yeah. enough time so that I have enough time to prepare for yeah. the fifth anniversary. Um, and then the show after that will be playing um, 7800 games and then Lynx and Jaguar games mm. after that. Excellent. And then the next show is the fifth annual uh, Atari Homebrew Awards live presentation at the end of February. Wow. I mean, we're already on the 8th, so it's 25th? coming quick. Yep, 25th. Everything's very, so very busy. Quick. February yes. is so busy. March, <laughs> oh, so, April. So, so busy. The next few months, my goodness. Yep, well, that's happening. My goodness. So let's let up Wordle as Wordle. requested. Or Word Guess. Word Guess, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, Word Guess. The 2600 version. For 2600. So there you go. Alrighty. And I'll switch over so everyone else can play along as well. All right. Yay. Word guess. Press fire. I love the rainbow. Oh, it's beautiful. Um, uh, is it Vroom also has the beautiful yes. rainbow? Vroom um, uses that uh, version uh, of that as well. Yeah. Yep. Title. When it gorgeous. goes to black and white, you see that faded away. Yeah. All oh. A's. Okay, so I'm gonna start with Sprite. I think uh, it's also a pretty decent. That's too many letters. Sprite. Oh, you're right. <laughs> start with Pixel. Pixel. It's a terrible guess, but we can start with it. Yeah. Just, just cause. Just cause. Yeah, there's not going to be X in this. If there is, that would be hilarious. Be amazing. But it does have an E. E is good. I is good. L, not P bad. Is okay. L's very good. X. Mm -mm. Any letters that are given as bonus, as, as automatic on Wheel of Fortune are very good letters. Yeah. <laughs> so I is in the right place. That I. is not terrible. Okay. Uh, so start your guesses. See. Guesses anytime. Um, so no E. We haven't tried S yet. yet. Yeah. Um, so I, maybe an A somewhere. Let's go for a vowel here. Yes, it has to be a word. Yeah. No. <laughs> 
Uh, smoked um, asked if it has to be a word. Yeah, it has to match a word in its dictionary. And uh, it has a fairly extensive dictionary. So what are you going for? An N? No idea. Um, um, hidden. Hidden? No, it can't let's be. Let's go for an S somewhere. Let's try an S at the beginning. <laughs> We're just like randomly, uh, S I something A N. Uh, <laughs> Uh, lives. Yeah, let's try it. No, can't nope, be any. No ease. No, don't want to waste uh, waste a guess. I'm terrible at this game. No L. Yeah. Something. Siren. Like... No, that has an E. No ease. Wow. I'm glad there's no timer. <laughs> yeah. Uh, signs. signs. There we go. Thank you. Yeah, let's two S's, that go. but that's fine. No, that sounds like a good. You never know; guess. we might match at the end. And it gets that N in there, which is good. G is an okay letter. I'm sleepy. Oh my goodness. Oh. No, I just. Your day's almost done. Oh, oh, no, oh. no. Still only an I. Hey, there has to be an A. Yeah. For the bells. A, U. No S's. T. Oh, oh. That could be an O as well. Birch. Birch. Birch is very good. That's a very good guess. Thank you, Nostalgic. Yeah, C and H are good ones, so. Yes. Whoa! Ooh. Very good. Okay, so we just have these. I would guess Finch, but uh, N is already taken. Mm. What could it be? I could put a T there. Ditch. But ditch. Let's try ditch because uh, let's get that B out of the way. Yep. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um. Change the B. Oh no! What? Oh, maybe it is bitch. <laughs> no. No. Uh, uh, stitch. No. Uh, witch. Hitch? No. Could be witch. Witch? No. Well, no. W? No. Is that right? Yep. She's. Oh no! One more what? guess. Sitch. <laughs> it's a real situation. Uh, oh, what is another word? Hitch. Uh, H and H. Eight. No, it's already been... Well... Yeah, it can. It can be Hitch. What's another possibility, though? <sighs> J-K-L Lich, which is no. a real word, but... No, it's not. It is. <laughs> it's a thing. Pitch. L. Ooh, it could be Pitch. Ooh, what are we going to do? No, it can't be because of the nope. P. Okay. Hitch still works. L -M <laughs> Down to the last one here. N-O-P-Q-R... <laughs> S T Leech U, <laughs> V It's gonna be Hitch. Yeah! Yes! Just made it. Only Just. got one point, unfortunately. Alright. So next I wouldn't do Pixel. Retro? That's, that's too that's not a great guess. What which one are you gonna put in? Retro. Retro? Uh, not the greatest to guess either, but... Um, uh, it's got a, a lot of good letters, though. It does. I cannot... Sure, let's do retro. Is it L-I-C-H? Yeah, it might be L-I-C-H. Not L-I-T-C-H. Oh, we can put in a tart. We'll do that one for third. Let's see if it accepts it. Whoa! Okay, wow. we got an R, an E, and a T. I bet it's T. Oh no. T H. Wet. R E T. Wet. 
could be there. Um, it could be there. Let's try there. No, because the... No, it wouldn't be. The R. The R would be correct then. Oh. Uh, mitre. Tears. tears. Ooh, I like tears. No, it's not tears. E no. is wrong. E... No, it is. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Mitre. Biter. Biter. Yikes. Trace. T-R... Yeah? Let's go Trace. Trace is good. It gets the A in there. Uh, C is meh. But Trace is Trace will be a good one. Treat. That's a good one. Could be Treat. Well, it could be Treat. Well, we'll see. see how this one goes. And it might, we might go for Treat. Of course, that has a double letter, too. Oh, well, R. Oh, and R and E. Okay, the R and E are in the right place. Oh, it's not Treat the anymore. The T is going to have to be in this position for sure. Um, right, that'll help. Um, uh, it's not an A. Not an A. No. So something. An O? I? I, U, I. Let's try I. See what that looks like. Trite. Trite. Bright? Uh, no. Mm, uh, it's a bad spelling of it. <laughs> bright? I don't know, I don't know if that's a... Word? a... Right. Ooh, right. Right. Yeah, good call. Atari 2600, dude. No! <gasps> oh no, but we confirmed no. the T, which we kind of already knew because So it's not an A, it. it's not an I. It could be an another o? E. It could be an O. No, it would have. Oh yeah, it could be another E. Rote. No, it can't be rote. No, the W's out now. Something. No, it's not no. You're right. It can't be a no. No, oh, that's right. It's not a no. A U? No. Root. Root. Note. That doesn't work. What could it be? It's not an A, an brute? I, or brute. an O. Brute. Thank you. Oh, brute would work. very good. Let's try brute. Oh, it's spitting around. Spitting? Good guess. Ding, Yay! Ding, ding. Two Atari points. 2600 and Vitoko. Let's start okay. with, um, what was I, Atari. Atari. I don't think that's a word, and I think we already tried it. Anything with a T and an R and a vowel is, is, is a good starting point, so. Oops. You probably want a word with five independent letters, but that's Always. okay. Always. Whoa. Ah, oh, so we've got A's, A's and I's. Two A's? I think that's what it implies. I think it does mean it's two A's, because the other... Yeah, you're right. Okay. Wow. That's a lot of... But it doesn't start with an A. It's a lot so of vowels. I would say... Put the A where the T is. I'm a process of elimination kind of person and here. And the other A at the end? Well, there's an I and an A. Ooh. What are you going to do with that? It's probably AI. And then an A at the end. Do you end. think there's two A's? Mania. Ho oh, ho. Wow. Atari 2600, dude. Are you cheating? <laughs> That's a really good guess. He's just really good at it. That's gotta be it. Wow. Whoa. Oh my yeah. goodness. Great job. Nice. Space, okay. space I'm going to start with space. I okay. like that. Just because. This will be a, a spare last one. Good starting point. I like this crowdsourced uh, <laughs> wordle. It is good. Helps a lot. <laughs> space. Final And frontier. it's a slow enough game that the lag These time These are between... the voyages of the Starship Enterprise. That's right. And it's continuing mission. What, is, what, what comes after that? To seek out new life. Yeah. And new civilizations to boldly go where no, no one has gone before. No man has gone before. before. No one. Right, Who's the new made. one? <laughs> uh, nice. It's on theme. There's an Atari Mania yeah. for modern systems. Oh, nice. All right. No S, no E. We have an A. Atari Mania. No P, no C. That's so, not much of a hint. Let's um, put the A here. Yeah, that's a good spot. Uh... Uh, 
try. Oh no, it's no S's, eh? Um... I'm very bad at guessing them because I haven't. Especially when there's no E. So many words have E's. Every word I think of is like, oh, it has an E. Yeah. Oh, that has an E too. Uh, fault. F A U L T. It gets a T in there and an L, which are both very good. And a vowel is always nice. Oh, I didn't look at the final <laughs> uh, scores for it. So 73%. Yeah. Uh, voted no. <laughs> oh. They, did, they didn't. Uh, start looking at anything start looking new. At, but 26 percent said they have one out of four people said they started looking at other systems because of the show that's okay. that's actually really good i thought it would be lower no t mm. wow no t but no we've L's, got the a no e's no u's i, I um i know you i oh yeah so something with an a warty no no t's no t's be an I. Uh, uh Reigns. R A I N S. No Gets, S. Damn it. <laughs> Put it anyway. An R is good. And an N is good too. Unless somebody can come up with a better one. Uh no. Got yeah, Reigns. No rings, there's an S. I know. But we can't think of a better one. It'll, it'll get two really good letters in How there. How about Rainy? Ooh, Rainy. Better. Oh my goodness! Wow! <laughs> From one letter. Atari 2600 dude said it, but I didn't oh, even look over there. Didn't see I that. was like, I thought Rainy and I, I hadn't seen your, your suggestion. Radio is a very yeah. good guess as well. Yeah. Rainy, excellent. Good stuff, everyone. Yes. Thank you for helping. Yes. That was very, very, very good. Dumb F and luck. luck. Yeah, sometimes it it, that's what happens. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sometimes it kind of leads you on a path and then you fill things in based on ones. Atari dude is He's cheating. cheating. <laughs> he's got some really good answers. Yeah, some really good suggestions he's there. He's really good or he's really cheap. <laughs> So thanks for tuning in, everyone. Yes. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow. I don't know what time. We'll have to figure that out. It's going to be late. It's going to be an after dark, which is fine. It's not a regular show. Yeah. It's a five it's fifth a anniversary special show. Special birthday show. show. Yep. Yeah. We'll not some... cheating. <laughs> Just good at the game. So we'll, uh, I'll yeah. either make some cake or some cupcakes. Oh, yeah. One of those two. Yeah. Tomorrow. Nice. How can you cheat on this? Easy. You, there's pages de oh. dedicated to this. You type in letters, what's left, what you've yeah. eliminated, it'll give you lists of words. <laughs> Haxor, yeah, it's Haxon. So thanks for uh, watching Chitlila, Rendered Ghost, Atari 2600, Dude, Danny VC, Smoked, Nostalgic, RC7E, Dios Kilos, Mini B, uh, Vitoko, Prow7, uh, Old Style, Msusa 3D, no kitties. No. Don't. Um, Carl G. Ricardo Pym. Ivory Tower Collections. Uh, Rendered Ghost. Don't know if I've said that already. Chal Sedani Mao. Phaser Cat Games. Phaser Cat Games. Hello. I see Cavamen 2D. S. Ramirez. Nice. Maybe B. Cubanismo. Uh, 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 Real old dude. Yeah. Atari 800 XL rules. Nice. And everyone else. Thank who you for is joining us. Lurking or went went away. Rendered ghost. I yeah. think you said that. Yes. Yeah. You used, calm down here, kitties. And um, we'll be back tomorrow at yes. an unknown time. So check the schedules. Check Twitch. Check the zero page homebrew page on uh, on the Atari Age forums or <laughs> or on uh, all the uh, all the regular. Social medias as well. Yes. I'll be 
talking about the fifth anniversary. So nice. hopefully people tune in. Yay! Um, and we're playing some cool new games, yes. including Rat Trap on the 7800. Ooh. Yes, brand new game, the full version of it, exclusive full version. Um, so definitely tune in for that, and uh, we will see you all tomorrow. Have a good night, everyone. Yes. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.